Honey, would you open up the curtains? Yeah. Thank you. Oh, it's gray out. Are we waiting for something? Well, a miracle would be nice. Well, other people have had miracles. Why shouldn't we? Oh, I don't know. I think we've been pretty lucky. We've had our fair share, haven't we? I mean, think of it. The five of us, well, with Kristen, the six of us. <sighs> we've been pretty lucky. You survived cancer. The four of you have absolutely fabulous, wonderful children. And Lord knows we've had great lives. Oh, your feet are cold, honey. I'll get another blanket, Mother. No, no, that's okay. He doesn't really like more than one. Hey, Mom, when does the nurse come? I called her and I told her not to come. But, Mom, she has to feed him. The doctor's already done that, sweetheart. Mother, there are other things they have to do for him. Not now. What do you mean, not now? Is Daddy dying? Probably, honey. Is that what the doctor told you? Well, he doesn't have all the answers, but probably. Listen, Mother, I'm, I'm going to run home and check on Alexander, and I'll be right back. Okay. okay, do me a favor. In the master bathroom, my old sink, um, I, I used to keep a basin there. If it's still there, would you fill it up with some warm water and bring it back in here for yeah. me? Yeah, yeah. Thank you. Hey, Mom, you know what? You have to eat, too. Oh, mm -hmm. well, there's nothing in the kitchen. Donald lives here kind of like a college kid. I'll go out and get us something to eat. Thank you, sweetheart. I don't know if there's still some... I used to keep towels in that drawer. Would you see if there are a couple in there? And if they are, would you bring them over to me? You're not thinking of giving Daddy a bath all by yourself? <laughs> no, honey. I couldn't lift them if I wanted to. Please don't try. I won't. Would you like this? Um, right there. Thank you. Okay. Uh, listen, um, thank you both for humoring me. I know you don't believe it, but I know your father heard you. I don't know where you're headed from here, darling, but when you get there, your feet will be warm. How many miles do you suppose we've walked in this world together, huh? I bet from the moon and back. I don't like you going ahead without me. But I can't begrudge you, I think. You will have your little adventures, won't you? Bless you, Eric. Bless you for everything that you've given me in my life. Bless the day you were born, and bless the day I first saw you. Bless the day we were married. And even bless all the anger and the hurt that we caused one another. It's so unimportant now bless all the lives we brought into this world together. Our children. It was all goodness, whether we knew it or not. Oh! Oh. Hey. Ah. He couldn't leave. <laughs> Your father moved his foot and it startled me. I did that sometimes in the hospital. 
Hey, Bob, do you want to be alone? No, no, no. I'm glad you stayed. You know, your father never wrote me love letters. But here you are, the three of you. And I realize you are love letters. Thank you.